Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a two-box break of 2020-2021 Prism Premier League Soccer, the EPL English Premier League, random club break number six. All cards ship. There are the teams right there. Some pretty nice stuff in this breakaway release. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and clubs seven times. Two and a five. One, two, three, four, five, six, and six. There's six. And seventh and final time. We got Jonathan down to Matthew Shearer after seven. Two and a five, seven times for the teams. One, two, three, six. And seventh and final time. After seven, we got Everton down to the Sheffield United West Brom combo. All right, Jonathan with Everton, Andrew with Brighton, Hove Albion, Robert, you got my club, Liverpool, Matthew with Aston Villa, Rob with Man City, Yi Tan with Burnley, Jason with Arsenal, Caleb with Tottenham Hotspur, Robert with Southampton, Andrew with Chelsea, Tang with Fulham, Michael with Man United, uh, Jarrell with Newcastle United, Chris with, Wol with the Wolves, Caleb with Crystal Palace in the Leeds combo, Yi with, the, uh, with West Ham United, Jason with Leicester City, and Matthew Shearer with... Uh, Sheffield United, the Blades, and West Bromwich Albion. All right, let's sort this by column B. And we'll uh, hit the pause button, see if there's going to be any uh, trades. And when we come back, we'll have the break. Why is control all not working? There you go, control all. Come on, keyboard. All right, I'll be right back. All right, welcome back, folks. There was some trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. But that is that is all right, no big deal. Thanks for spending a bit of your uh, your Saturday, your Saturday, your Thursday with us. I'll be here on Saturday though. Spend some spend some Saturday with me. A lot of college basketball to be watched this week, and that's gonna be a lot of fun. And I'm sure there's some Premier League action happening on the weekend too. Take a look. Any Premier League act? There is. Fulham is hosting Leeds on Friday, tomorrow. Saturday's slate. Oh, we got. Oh, it's an FA Cup weekend. Bournemouth and Southampton facing each other in the FA Cup. Everton is going to be hosting Man City. That should be that should be interesting. That should be a good match, actually. There is some Premier League action happening. Uh, Brighton Hove Albion will be hosting Newcastle United and Tottenham. The Tottenham Southampton game postponed. Oh, because Southampton's. In the FA Cup, so I guess that that fixture will be moved elsewhere. On Sunday, the twenty-first, looks like Chelsea is hosting Sheffield United in an FA Cup matchup, and Leicester City is hosting Man United. And then West Ham is playing Arsenal. Aston Villa hosting Tottenham. In the, this is Premier League action. Maybe is there a Monday night game? No, I think on Monday we start a Champions League week. PSG and Lyon. No, that's Women's Champions League. Australian A-League. CONCACAF Men's Olympic Qualifier. There's so much soccer going on. A lot of footy. FA Cup action, some Premier League action this weekend. And Women's Champions League. And tons of college basketball. All right. Good luck, everybody. Oh, kaboom! Right out of the gate, Jay Rodriguez. Kaboom. Second, that's not going to fit a regular top loader. There you go. Nice one for uh, Burnley. 
That's the Burnley shield, right? Yeah, that's Burnley. Clarets. And that will be for... E10 with Burnley. Nice one, E. Yeah, he's not, not a bad player either. He's pretty solid. This Man City team logo card is also really nice for Robert. I think these are pretty short printed, so that should be a lot of fun right there. All right, now let's see if we got any anyone else. We got Reese Nelson, Harry Kane, Harry Maguire, David De Gea to 195 for Man United. Here's Jay Rodriguez right there. Harry Kane for Tottenham going to Caleb. We got Mohamed Salah. Nice for Liverpool going to Robert. We got Alexis Mac McAllister. 20 out of 25 for Brighton. Andrew with that one. A nice Obama Young card back there. Like even some of those common cards could go for a lot in the secondary market. There's Trent. There is Tom Kearney to 195 for Fulham. That'll be for Tang. Next stack here. There's a nice emergent Mason Greenwood. And a nice Bukayo Saka for Jason and Arsenal. It's one of the one of the probably one of the better players to get in this set. That is awesome. Jason with Arsenal. Man United gets the Mason Greenwood. There's Ben Osborne. Remember these these pulsars are are the exclusives to the breakaway set, and a nice Phil Foden, fifty five out of ninety nine for Man City. Robert, with that one. The Hyunmin Son, another great player to get. Caleb, looking for that auto, looking for that tried to trade, couldn't trade mojo. It's Paul Pogba. Scored a goal in Europa League action, a silver rookie. There's Foden again, another rookie. All right, so we got a lot going on here. Here's Fabian Delph for Everton. Jonathan, so that's to 195. Here's Bruno Fernandez. That's for Michael Golder and Man United. We got Fulham's. Neskins, Cabano for Tang. Man City, Robert with the Phil Foden. Just the base. Rookie Silvers are always important. Ben Osborne, Sheffield. That'll be for Matthew and the Sheffield West Brom combo. And here's Pogba. Scored a goal in Europa League action earlier today. Alright, that was box one. Here's box two. Yes. I hit the bell. The bell wanted to make an appearance. It's like, what about me? Maybe the bell feels a, uh, a train whistle in this box here? In gold power? A one of one, maybe? Mm, that'd be nice.
right. So who are, who are the the sad teams in the in the Premier League? It looks like Sheffield United is definitely going down. They only have 14 points on the season. Next is they're in 20th place. In 19th place is West Brom with 18 points. Fulham has 26 points. So they're battling with pretty much Newcastle and Brighton. Hoping they don't hoping they could switch out of the relegation spot and so last handful of games is gonna be pretty important for uh, for those clubs right there. I don't think West Brom and Sheffield have a chance. I think they're they're pretty much done. But Fulham still has a chance to crawl out of the relegation space. I think Burnley is clear with thirty three points unless they completely S the B. Southampton Wolves should be fine, Leeds, Crystal Palace, these are all mid table teams now. Ars uh, Arsenal, Aston Villa, Tottenham, Everton, Liverpool are in sixth place. They're tied with Everton. Trying to. Points wise, it doesn't seem like they're too far off a Champions League spot, but it's going to be pretty difficult for them. Maybe they'll get fifth if they can get past West Ham United, the Euro Europa League spot. No, <laughs> that'd be a disaster if Liverpool ended up in a relegation battle. I can't imagine that there there must be scenarios, right? Like what happens if, like what happens if a massive club like Man City or Man United or Chelsea, Liverpool, Arsenal, all those like big big clubs that are worth so much money, like what happens if they get relegated? I mean, that's disaster, right? All that TV money is gone. There's McAllister for Brighton. That'll be for Andrew. All the match day revenue, although there hasn't really been much during the pandemic, but all that potential match day revenue in a normal season would be gone. I think it'd be... I don't know what would happen. They'd have to sell off a ton of. They'd have to sell off all almost all their players. There's Nathan Tella. There's Timo Werner for Chelsea. That's going to be for Andrew. And Matt Phillips for West Brom. That'll be for Matthew. They'd have to sell off all of their players. And, and they'd have to uh, probably fire a lot of staff, a lot of media staff, a lot of like social media teams and marketing teams. All of that would be cut. There's Hector Bellerin for Arsenal, Jason. Devastator saying Arsenal was headed that way earlier this season. But yeah, that'd, that'd be disastrous. There's Sami Ajay. Ajay. There's Bernardo. Is that any relation to Jay Ajayi? Jay Ajayi is English. Maybe not. Is it a common name, Ajayi? No, it's not. No, no relation. All right, that's for West Brom, Matthew. There's Bernardo Silva, Man City, Robert. That's to 195. I'm sure Premier Leagues, like the big clubs, have like a have like a plan if that happens. If like the worst case scenario happens, there must be like a small binder behind glass that you'd have to crack with two keys. In case of disaster, there's Chris Wood for Burnley. That'll be for Yi. There's Giovanni Lo Celso to 195 for Tottenham. That's for Caleb. There's Mason Mount for Chelsea. For Andrew. And we got David De Gea, 46 out of 99 for Manchester United, Michael Golder. Danny Ings to 
Michael Wilton, Nick Pope, Mohamed Salah, Tommy Doyle, Rookie Silver, Juan Basaka, and McAllister at the end. There you have it, folks. That was two box random club break number six of 2020 Panini Prism Premier League Soccer, the EPL. Thanks for watching. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for another one a little bit later tonight. Bye-bye.